Uh, hey everyone, uh, Sim Sly here. Now, you may be wondering why I haven't been posting much lately. Um, it's because I don't know. I've just been, I've just been off of YouTube for a little bit. I've just been doing doing other things. But I promise you, I'll get back to making more videos. But anyway, uh, I was looking through the Smash Bros Ultimate website, and I was looking through um, some of the some of the stuff in the website like the files and stuff I'm not sure how to make it like I don't I don't I want to be like more user-friendly like use more user-friendly terms but um, look through I look through files I look through the the stuff in the the website and I'm I'm surprised I mean I'm probably not the only one who's noticed this but I'm like one of the few but I saw, I, I found music tracks for uh, Smash Bros. Ultimate that hasn't been on the website, and um, I mean, maybe no one's talking about this because it's, it's spoilers and they're leaks and Nintendo, you know, doesn't want people knowing, but um, yeah, I found these tracks. And uh, some of these, you'll know, you'll notice that um, actually all of these that I found don't have icons, and um, that's because they're they're not on the website. They're not on the site's files. I tried looking, I ju I just could not find them. But uh, yeah, the the sounds are in the website, and uh, yeah, it's pretty interesting now. Um, there's some songs that are for uh, represented series. That's such a weird term to use. Uh, represented franchises that haven't been announced. So uh, if you don't want to know, click off this video. And um, yeah, we'll we'll start uh, getting to the songs now. The first one's a remix. For Super Mario World's castle theme, uh, let's take a listen. It's a pr it's a pretty nice remix. I re I really like this one a lot. Smash Bros. Ultimate's uh, music is really good. It's one of it's one of my favorites. Brawl Brawl is like my favorite. That has like my favorite songs. But I would say I would say this almost tops it. It's a, it's got a pretty good collection of music so far. So now the next one is uh, Mr. Sandman uh, from Punch Out. It's like the Wii version of Punch Out, uh, arranged by Mike Peacock. Uh, pretty nice name. And right, let's take a listen. It seems like it's it's kind of like the original version kind of I'm pretty sure I've only played the game once but it's kind of like the original version it's not much of a remix uh, anyway uh, now let's get into the juicy stuff we have our final destination music by Chih Chiharu Sakayama not really good at pronouncing Japanese names, but this one's this one's pretty good. This one's pretty good. Have a have a listen. So good. Yeah, yeah, that's basically it. Um, oh, man, that's a that's a good Final Destination song. I mean, all the Final Destination songs I love. They're they're all really good, but this one, 
<laughs> I love that one. That's such a good one. Now, is this the... Is this the... Yes, it is. Okay, okay. Now, this is the spoiler. This is the franchise that hasn't been revealed yet. And I'm pretty sure lots and lots of people are going to care. So, if you care, click off the video. Now, uh, get this. Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts and the new Smash Bros. I think I think Sora's in the new Smash Bros. And uh, they got the Riku and Ansem theme in it, which pretty good choice of music, I would say. Let's listen. Yeah, it's I'm a, I'm a big fan of Kingdom Hearts. That's a pretty good song. Uh, but yeah, there's not much to talk about uh, about the song, cause you know it's just it's just a regular song. But um, I'm glad Kingdom Hearts is uh, basically confirmed. But uh, now, <laughs> you you guys won't expect this one, okay? Uh, I would really click off the video, like right now, if you care about spoilers because this one's a big one and I know fans have wanted this kind of representation for the longest of time but uh, let's get into it <sighs> yep Burly Steam they got Dragon Ball they got Dragon Ball Z <laughs> in Super Smash Bros Ultimate now personally I'm the person who is like, why would they put anime in the game? But Sakurai did himself. They, they, <laughs> they got, they got with Dragon Ball, and it's pretty impressive. I mean, I, I mean, the, I'm, I'm just at a loss of words. Uh, let's listen to the song. Yeah, that's a that's a good song. I really like that. I'm I'm glad they chose that theme. I really like Broly as a character. He's a really he's a really cool character. And um, yeah, so I guess I guess Goku's a playable character, and they'll have this they'll have this song. I mean, he might. I mean, sometimes they put music in the game, and they don't put the character in. But you know, and um, now. Now here's where you might want to click off. I'm not even joking here. Here, there, there's like major spoilers beyond this point. It's like it's like the last song that I found today for you guys. But uh, get a load of this. You can't touch this by MC Hammer. I don't know how or why they got this in the game. But they did it. They did it. Let's let's listen to such a good song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You you guys get it. I don't want to get copyright claimed. So. Let's not continue listening to that. And, uh, yeah, that's all the songs that I found throughout the website so far. Uh, Nintendo doesn't really know that people are able to look on the website, inside the website, and find the files, so that's kind of concerning. But uh, I'm sure they'll fix it in the future. But, uh, one last thing. Um, as you... If you noticed, 
they changed the main theme from like the E3 version to the just the main theme. Which means here's the entire finished theme. Let's take a listen.